Oh man, dude. What's going on guys? Back at it with another series here on the channel. This one, admittingly, is a game that I was not going to play at first. But it wasn't until, you know, a couple of you guys actually gave me, uh, I guess the suggestion to play Gears and... It, I guess, in a nutshell, I looked into it and it looked fantastic. And I decided to, you know, pick it up and play it for myself here on the channel. So a little quick background to this, I actually loved playing Gears of War way back in the day. I think it was like 2005, 2006 when the original one came out, when the original Gears of War came out. And I was pretty much a fanatic right from the beginning. And I gotta say nothing has changed here because I love Gears. It's a game that I played pretty extensively throughout my early years. Uh, of course, I played Gears of War 1, 2, and 3, and unfortunately, I wasn't able to play Gears of War 4, even though it was a title that I really, really was interested in. But at the time, I was in the military, and balancing gaming and my, my career was very difficult, so essentially, in long story short, I didn't get to play it. But here we are with Gears of War 5, or Gears 5, it's gonna be hard for me not to say Gears of War. But Gears 5, and I'm kind of hoping that it does build onto the story, but it's more of a standalone thing than uh, an actual continuation because I won't know what's going on if it continues on from Gears of War 4. But with that being said, let's go ahead and jump into this gameplay. Enough of me rambling. Previously on Gears. We used to protect Cox settlements. Now we're about to raid one. <laughs> Raiding is what outsiders do. Lieutenant, you've been busy. Look, our village hasn't had power in weeks. We need this fabricator. I don't care about the goddamn fabricator. You're taking my people. What happened? The short version? The cop is on his way. You promised me you could steal that fabricator without provoking Jin. This has nothing to do with a fabricator. Then what did you do? Jin accused us of taking her people. Yeah, whatever that means. Get the fabricator to the power station and install the inverter. You realize Jin's coming back, right? We need to leave now. Mom! Hey, listen. You need to hide, and then you need to run. <laughs> as well as I do, that he can help. Our village was attacked. And my mother was taken. Taken? Dad, you should look at this. Shit. Uh, guys? Thought you said you weren't running from the car. Yeah, that wasn't completely accurate. We need to get through that fort to the abandoned Osborne line on the other side. The car dumped a few thousand locust bodies in there after the war. Swarms related to the grubs, we'll find out there. Treated like the others. 
not parted. I'm released. I'll die. It's okay. She wanted you to have that. It was my grandmother's. I never knew her. ready for this. She can barely keep her eyes open. Don't worry about her. She'll be ready. Okay, we're almost at Barrett's coordinates. Welcome to Azura. Slept. Last night, got a good eight or nine minutes in. Nightmares. Does it get better? It gets tolerable. Alright, so I am controlling now. And we're already breaking enough of them as it is. What Jin doesn't know won't hurt her. This is my call, alright? If the first minister doesn't like it, she can yell at me. Which she almost certainly will. Tell us where to go, control. I'll do my best, but remember, no one's been in that facility for like 25 years. Yeah, that's pretty evident. You're not there to buy a timeshare, you're there to launch an old hammer of thumb prototype. And your intel says one of the silos is still intact, right? Yeah, as far as they can tell. Just get Dave to a functional control room. He'll handle the launch sequence. Alright, so... First things first. You can tell Kate has a lot on her mind right now. Second of all is... Wow. This game is gorgeous. All right, so I'm kind of just pushing buttons right now to figure out some of the gameplay mechanics. Holy crap, that scared me. So I actually really enjoyed the fact that it came with the, like a prologue at the beginning because I didn't get to play, like I said in the uh, in the very beginning or whatever, I didn't get to play Gears of War 4 and the fact that it had that in there, it was just amazing. Thank you, Dave. Remember, big locust burial site in this island. If it hatched, we're gonna be waist deep in swarm. So one hell of a way to come back to Azura. Marcus, yeah, I love you. Satellites up, we can fry the swarm from orbit. Hey, hey, get back! Oh shit! What the hell? Whoa. Uh, I'm gonna search a place that's falling apart. Wait. Come on, we can use the ledge. So another thing 
You guys plan to launch a satellite from here? It seems a little half-baked. Yep. Well, half-baked plans are kind of Baird's specialty. How Baird even figured out they had a hammer satellite here? My father. Before he died, he let Baird in on a few cog secrets. In this island, it has plenty of them. All right, so another thing uh, that I wanted to say before Marcus started talking and rudely interrupted me. This game has some of the best facial animations I've ever seen in a video game. I really have to emphasize that. This game is gorgeous. Hey, over there. Could be useful. Wait, what is... X? Hey, fetch. Oh, that's freaking awesome, dude. Give it to me. Alright, get the other thing. Where is it? There it is. Thank you, Dave. You're an amazing robot. Alright, what now? Can I jump down there? I don't think so. How do you run? I don't want to walk the whole time. Huh. Didn't expect there'd still be bodies. Only a handful of us made it off as we're alive. Whoa. All my people are dead. Man, this game is beautiful, dude. I love it. So, to everyone <laughs> that was basically telling me to get this game to play it, thank you. I, I'm very grateful for you guys because I swear on everything, it's amazing. Right, RB, RB. Okay, Woohoo! Oh man, I used to love the, I used to love that chainsaw. Stay back. We're coming down. Alright. So it kinda seems like this game is really loud, so I'm I'm actually gonna drop the audio the game audio for just a little bit all right so that should hopefully be better we'll see who? Dave, send a pulse and let's see what we're dealing with that's that's ah, awesome i'll take care of this one <laughs> oh oh All right, I'm going loud. Let's put him down. Get in the cover. Come on, big boys. Oh, he got me good. Oh, he just he just pulled him. Toss a frag if you got him. More drones. How do I toss a frag? Whoa! Yo, this game... This game is badass, dude. Alright, that's all of them. Woohoo! It's confirmed. The Durapurial site is active. Shit. Okay, Condor's in the air. Nah, I'm taking the Lancer, dude. We get it handled for now. Delta out. Come on, we're gonna find one of those silos. Assuming the swarm haven't ripped them all apart. Alrighty. Where are we supposed to go? Here? Oh, okay, there we go. Shit. Sorry. What's wrong with you, girl? Okay, these headaches. So I gotta say. Kate is freaking gorgeous. For the record, you don't seem okay. Yeah, <laughs> that's very astute there, Marcus. <laughs> it's too many active hives. Everywhere we go, another burial site's hatched. All the more reason to get the hammer of dawn alive. Let's hope Jin sees it that way. I, 
It's kind of like, uh, I'm getting vibes from, uh, crap, what's, uh, what's that game? Oh, crap. Oh, that was dope. You're done. Do I have finishing moves? Oh, done skis, bro. Oh. Got him. Oh, you're not going nowhere, bro. Shot him right in the booty. All right, got them all. Give me some ammo. Wait a second. Guys, we're in a silo. Baird, we found one of the silos, but it's wrecked. Well, there's two more. One Dang. Look at all the gore. Hope you're right. We ended the war once on this island. When we get this hammer satellite up, we can do it again. That's the idea, old pal. Control out. All right, so I could destroy this, right? Epicness. So, straight's not an option. How much rocket base is even left? Let's find out. You guys go right, Marcus and I will go left. We'll find those sides. Ooh, do I get to control so Kate? Good. I want to play as Kate, dude, like hardcore. Sure She's such a badass. Oh, I guess I'm still JD. Which I'm okay with too. JD's a badass too. Man, that something I wanted to say too, though, is like that intro prologue really made me want to play Gears of War 4. I might have to play it on my own. Unless you guys want me to play it here. Let me know down in the comments. This looks like some kind of exhaust tunnel. But is it from a silo? Only one way to find out. Dude, look at the lighting. The lighting effects is amazing. I love it. Oh, oh, that was terrible. Oh, oh, get out of my way, bro. I'm not trying to commit fratricide. Oh. Oh. No, 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 no. Dude, I almost... I almost died. Man, this game feels great, dude. All right, hammer time. Dude, if this entire game, look at, look at him, dude. Now, let's figure out. Del, come here. Del, come here. Del, come here. Look at this, dude. Stand still so I can see the. Never mind. Never mind, Dell. So the Retro Lancer. I'm tempted. But now it's. I'll, I'll just stick to my chainsaw. What's this? Alright, looks like this sluice gate's our way out. 
Look at all my boys, man. They're all dead. You get this open. Man, you know what? If they want to turn this place into a hive, let them. It's an isolated island hundreds of miles from shore. Uh-huh. Let's just make sure that happens after we leave. I don't even think it's a good idea to do it after we leave either. They'll eventually want to expand. Gets it. Okay, let's find that silent. Oh shit. Woohoo! So much for a silo. Give me my ammo, bro. Alrighty. What's this? Oh look, there's uh, Marcus and uh, Kate. James, we're above you. Yep, I saw you. We can provide what is that? Kind of curious. Oh, he's invisible. Okay, now open fire. I wonder. Oh, 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 oh. let's let's try this thing. Oh crap, dude. That thing was amazing. Got him. Let's move forward, shall we? So how do I throw a grenade? Got another. You're done, skis, bro. Where do you think you're going? I can't believe how hard it was to kill that guy. I probably should have paid attention to how to throw grenades if it even taught me how. Oh, come on. Get out of my way, guy. I was trying to chainsaw, but he ended up reloading. <laughs> For some reason, he ended up just reloading. Stop getting in my way then, dude. So reload is weird. Reload is RB. And it's just weird because I'm used to it being like X. I don't know what the difference is. No! Come 
Come on. We got this! Uh. <laughs> that was... Oh, dude. I enjoyed that very much. I enjoyed that a lot. Look at that, they're even following me, dude. That's freaking epicness, dude. Nope, locked. We'll have to find another way to open it. Alrighty. Dave, check that tent. I don't know what that means. Oh wait. Did he just go in through here? Yo, dude, Dave is clutch, bro. That's sick. Look at my robot, dude. That dude's a badass. Whoa, Delta. What the hell did Dave do? Got a lot of strange data here. Top secret stuff. Uh, as far as I know, he's opening a door. He's doing a lot more than that. Well, either way, the door. Thanks, Dave. Thank you, so, Dave, indeed. That data Dave just downloaded? There's a big hole at the highest security clearance. How does this relate to our mission? It doesn't. But now I need to know. I'm guessing whatever's missing was pulled from the network. Well, who'd have the authority to do that? Me. Back then, uh, only the facility commander. Find his office and poke around. Okay. Wilco. Wilco. I love that they're using military terms. For those of you guys who don't know, Wilco is... Will comply. No, well, compared to you, it definitely is inferior. That's just me. Was Dave just talking shit? Kind of sounded like it. Let's go, Dave. All right, where to this way? Oh, of course. Shit. Sion! DB, take it out! They killed my robot! Oh, crap. I didn't even see that guy. Nice try. Got him. I want his gun, dude. Alrighty. Oh wait, he's dead. I, got you. I don't even know how to protect to get you. I'm stuck. Blank, homie. Come on. Yeah, there. Woo. Now let's find that office. What does the facility commander's office even look like? Well, I don't know. Take a big door, nameplate, maybe commander written on it. 
Get in there. Baird once lost data, huh? What does it even look like? Well, if it got pulled from a network, it probably got stored on some kind of external drive. Maybe. Hey. Nice one, Dave. Del, commander's office is through here. Man, this door is locked. I don't even need it. Thank you, though, Dave. You are straight up epicness. Very nice. All right, come on over here. Let's look around. Safe. Good place for secret data. Oh, okay, cool. Get this open. Dave, you're an amazing, very handy robot. Gotcha. Hey, Control. Good news. We found the data drive. Appreciate it, Delta. Hey, know what we'd appreciate? Some backup. What? Where are you? The silo. We found it. And they're all over us. Oh, uh, we got you, Kate. We're on our way. Dave, open this. Or can I open it? Let's get her done. I'm assuming it's on this side. Yes, it is. Oh shit, they were good. Man, we leave you guys alone for five minutes. Yeah, it's goddamn hilarious. Just help us clear them out. Come on. That was a bad reload. I have no idea how to use this, so I'm just not. Come on. Holy crap, that guy's tanky. <laughs> oh. I'm feeling this game. All right. Control room's clear. Nice you guys to show up. Oh, no problem. Is that rocket attack? It is, believe it or not. Good. Then find a port for Dave to plug into. If it checks out, he'll initiate the launch. Alrighty, so where to? Okay, right here. It's all yours. Control, you're in. Start the launch sequence. Pressurized. First stage. Opening silo doors. Error. Oh snap, it's a Error. rocket. Uh, Delta, we have an issue. Um it's not opening. Oh, of course. I knew that seemed too easy. Baird, options. Bug out. Blast doors aren't gonna protect you from an exploding rocket. All right, then we call it. Let's, Let's go. go. Let's go. No. You get that hatch open. What? Kid, listen to your old man. You got to get out of there. Damn it, we came here to do this, so let's get it done. Ignition test commence. Oh, snap. Stay with me. Ignition, engine one. Oh man, my daddy's pissed. Good luck with that. Let's get that hatch open. So what's our plan? I don't know. Got to be a manual override near the top. Let's find our way up. Oh. What the hell? Hey, follow that platform. 
That was definitely on accident. I can't even see him. Come on, Dave. Damn it, damn. We can get around. Let's go. Up there. Oh, I figured out how to run. Uh, that didn't work out very well. <laughs> that was sick as hell, dude. And that was done on accident because all I wanted to do was do the... Oh, crap. Okay, so how do I change my gun? Okay, there we go. Figured it out. Nice. Just in time. Really? He's a robot. Unbelievable. <laughs> Daddy's pissed. For extraction. They do look related. Man, that was literally just the intro. I see Jen first. 
calm the storm before you brief her. I'm sorry, is this Sergeant Phoenix being diplomatic? You can call her what you want, but we're at war, even if it doesn't feel like it yet. We all have to be on the same page. Yeah, well, I mean, if you think it'll help, then sure. Wish you'd have been this willing to listen back at that silo. Hey, it worked out, didn't it? Listen, James, word of advice. Stop trying to prove yourself. Just do the job. Dad, I took a necessary risk. Necessary means you have no other option. That wasn't necessary. And you know it. Oh, man. Intense father-son moment right there. What was that about? What do you think? Same thing it's always about. Hey. You know it's just because he cares, right? Yeah, well, you know a hell of a lot more about him caring than I would. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, um, we're just gonna go inside. Dave is all messed up and broken. That was a shitty thing to say. Yeah. yeah um, I'm sorry. I'm assuming that's a Gears 4 the reference. Is... You two are more alike than either of you want to admit. She's gorgeous, man. She really is. Damon, this dude looks exactly like Marcus, <laughs> with less scars and a little less weight. Thanks a lot, Iris. Your vocal sentiment does not match your words' literal meaning. Thus, you are not actually. Please stop talking. So I still can't find the other Hammer of Dawn satellites. On the plus side, I accidentally invented an AI that understands sarcasm. Here, <laughs> that data drive you wanted. <laughs> Maybe it'll help. Find lost satellites? I doubt it. But I'll take a look. Wait, hang on. Did we do all that for nothing? Oh, yep. it'll fire. But with only one working satellite up, it'll be tough to control the beam. Ah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> The kind that evolves himself ru ru running against the wall. I know I'm gonna regret this. Oh, it's a new Dave. Everyone, meet the new Jack. When the hell did you have time to build this? When did I have time to build this? This is what I do. I sit here making stuff you guys don't appreciate and inevitably break. Okay, so what's oh, it understood. Whole new range of behaviors. Improved scanning, augmented combat, and support modules. He's literally one of a kind. Uh-huh. And... Oh, of course. And he's... all yours. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I have a bazillion 40-year-old satellites to find. Damon, there are only 15 missing satellites. Thank you, Iris. More sarcasm to add to your Bazillion 15. So what's the difference? Before we begin, Damon, the combat module you brilliantly designed is now ready. My use of brilliantly was intended to be sarcastic. Did I succeed? <sighs> Follow me. You'll want to equip this new yes, module. Yes, ma'am. It'll make Jack combat ready. Oh, I'm gonna dig this. Oh, wait, so I can It'll upgrade Jack. Jack. What I've been calling Flash. Lines stuns the enemy. Nice. Oh, that's that's freaking awesome. So he makes him a lot more practical in combat. Jack can have one assault and one support ability equipped at a time. Okay, good to know. Open the jack menu, highlight the ability you want, and press A. Sounds good. So, assault, equipped. So, for... Okay, so he's got pulse and flash. So, there's two more assault ones, it looks like, and three more support. And passive abilities.
That's that's cool. Installed and equipped. So, how do we use it? I'll show you. Over here. Okay. Grab a weapon and get into cover. Then we'll start the test. Alright, so where's the weapon? Okay, right here. Fixes that. Aim at the DB and activate. See what happens. Flash! All right, finish it. Test sequence complete. That's dope. Huh. That could be useful. Now let's try it again with multiple targets. Very nice. Activate Alpha 332. Incoming, Damon. Jack's got to reroute power between flashes. Once he's recharged, hit him again. Uh, Alright, once he's recharged. Unit reloading. Jack Flash! Oh, two for one. Nice. Oh. Took him down. Nice work. Feel free to run it again if you want. No, I'm good. That was sick as hell. No, thank you. No offense, JD, but uh, Jack's my new best friend. I'm very happy for you, for both of you. But now I need you to return your weapons to the weapons locker and get out of here. Don't tell me what to do. I might just do it. Aw, oh, man, I want to keep my gun. Are you trying to get rid of us? Oh, you noticed. Anyway, <laughs> you can lose Jack's abilities if you find the right components. Before you go see Jin, stop by the armory. They might have one you can borrow. Oh, we will definitely be doing that. Good. Now I can get back to work. Many nights. What he means to say is that he has more important things to do. Thank you, Iris. Bluntness is one of Iris's more. Later, Baird. Come on, guys. <laughs> no worries. Do your thing. Goodbye, buddy. Come on. <gasps> this dude has one leg. Hey, Foz. How's life in Jin's rear echelon treating you? Brilliant. But then we can't all be off on some secret mission. Oh, yeah? How'd you hear about that? This is an army, not a monastery. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, look, we'll just leave you to the very important work punching machines. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on a second. What a cheap shot. Shit stick. Del, theories? I don't know. Or maybe a stick made out of shit? Or, or a stick used to stir up shit. Or, <laughs> fuck off. How about we make this interesting? You and me, spar right now. And how exactly is beating you interesting? Yes or no? Let's do it. You want in on this? Pretty sure what's actually being measured here is going to leave me at a distinct disadvantage. <laughs> Maybe not. Hilarious. Are uh, you in or not? Oh, I love it. Oh, I'm in. Come on, man. Let's just grab a jack component and get out of here. No, this should be fun. What? A, this guy is good at cheap shots. Try it again, Foss. Come on. Here's the thing, Foss. The battle spar with him, but not beat you. I guess they're programming, but explain. Shit, it's false confidence. Quite a bit, actually. Want some advice, Phoenix? No, I'm good. Jin does love her golden boys, but never for very long. Damn, this dude is salty. Fuck off. All right, man. Now that Fa's fun time's over, can we go find that component? What's this over here? Wait. Gotta tell you, that cheap shot. Mm. Chef's kiss, buddy. Chef's kiss. Never heard that saying before, Chef's Kiss. Is that it? I'm assuming that's a good thing? Kind of like admiring his cheap shot? Awesome. 
So just like all the other Let's Plays or whatever, if you guys want to read it, definitely feel free to push pause on those. I tend to read them during the editing process anyway, so... Get out of my way! Alright, see what it does. So you found a component. Jack has the ability to uh, upgrades and passives. Okay, cool. Okay. Cool. Alright, so let's go ahead and upgrade. Let me see. Stealth. Actually, I think the zapper might be... Also, with this, he can pick up heavier weapons, I'm assuming. I think Zapper would be the way to go. Improved. Jack can fire the Zapper for longer. Increases the Zapper's effective range. Multiple enemies at once. Uh, Let's do this one. Oh, I don't have enough. All right, so I think I'm. So I could do health. I could do pulse, or I could do flash. So with that, I think I'm gonna do flash. Nice. Say, loving the new jack. Can't wait to test him out in the field. Try to contain your excitement. You still have to go to Jim's office. Yeah. Has probably had enough alone time with her by now. Probably. Um, I'm not sure what I'm looking at. Oh, it's another upgrade. And now I get to upgrade this. I should have probably done the health. But I found two in this same room, so I'm assuming they're pretty common. <laughs> Never could get used to the feel of you in those things. Those helmets are badass. But yeah, I I agree with this assessment. All right, well let's go. I'm not sure where we have to go, but let's go nonetheless. What's up, Kate? Okay. What's with their headaches? Gotta see someone about these headaches. I will. I promise. After we talk to Jen. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold you up to that. What's this? I see shiny. I see shiny. Now I'm finding all kinds of collectibles in here. Oh, she's bored out of her mind. Let me be perfectly clear, when it comes to this weapon, I don't share your optimism. It's the first time anyone's accused me of optimism. Yes, well, <laughs> I'll remind you your wife refused the idea of bringing the hammer back online. I would have thought you'd respect Anya's wishes. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say that, for both our sakes. Anya would have wanted you, you to- You don't get to talk about her. If that's what you think, I won't argue. Oh, you crap, dude. Goddamn fertility program. A program that gave you your son and mine. I honor Anya. I loved Anya. I don't care if you believe me. When my program was in its infancy, she came to me. She volunteered. Both times she volunteered. Seeing First Minister Stroud undergo treatment. Do you know how many children are alive today thanks to her? Twelve. She should be buried here, you know. With the All Fathers. The people need her inspiration. Your inspiration was my wife. First Minister, Lieutenant Phoenix and his squad. Yep, I don't think they like each other. <laughs> Send them in. 
And I could have sworn he was there to calm her down. <laughs> ah, Lieutenant. I'm told you had a successful mission. First Minister, I can explain. By all means. Explain when Damon Baird superseded me. Explain how launching a Hammer of Dawn satellite doesn't require my explicit approval. Same page, huh? <laughs> Lieutenant, the Hammer of Dawn has taken more COG lives than most of the armies we've opposed. Your father knows this as well as anyone. It's not the weapons I don't trust, First Minister. It's the people who use them. Agreed. The Hammer of Dawn will not be brought back online. Ah, that'll be a report on the evacuation of Settlement 2. Settlement 2 is being evacuated? Why? There's been activity in the nearby burial site. Chief Carmine, report. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, slow down. Mobilize the 4th Division. We'll take command of the reinforcement effort. Do it. Go. Oh shit! Holy crap. That's intense. Thanks. Well, that sucked. Bear, look, our raven's down. You patch us through to Carmine? Uh, no can do, kid. His radio's out. You okay? I can see him at the central hub, so he's up and fighting, but the swarm's all over him. Hurry if you can. Run our way. Come on, Delta. Let's get out of here. All right, guys, uh, we've been at this for over an hour for one video, so we're going to have to call it an episode right here, right now. But of course, when we continue this game, we are going to literally pick up right at this very moment where we're leaving off. So with that being said, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to drop a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every single time 
I drop a new video here on the channel. So with that being said, catch you guys on the next video. Deuces.